Welcome back to the CB Square Podcast. My name is Chris. Cody. And today, we are going to be talking about... Episode 124. <laughs> <laughs> Mini EY. Yeah. Mini Anime EY. EY. It is this Sunday, yep. uh, two days two days from now, Anime Mini Mini EY. Why are you handing this to me? Well, because I need you to try with a fireball koozie, obviously. Does it taste any different? Nope. Still tastes like bush. What did I get? I don't know what it is. <laughs> Anyways, we're going, to mini, we're going to Mini EY. Yes, sir. And if you've seen our last review... Of anime EY, they've got some you know that it was standards a, to hold up. Okay? It was a major letdown last year, for, but for who? Anime EY, everybody. I was thrilled. <laughs> Said the entire time. <laughs> I was thrilled. If you watch my review, you see nothing but a smile. <laughs> Which I think the only reason why was because of the hotel. You think that was the only reason? Yeah. All only reason. I'm I'm almost positive because it would have been perfect. It would have been perfect if it was at a different hotel. I think the way that the hotel was designed made it fucking terrible. It was designed for failure. Yeah. Okay. Especially the party floor. Because it, w- it was like an open concept design. And the party floor is supposed to be on one floor. But if with, if it's an open concept like that, the party floor is on all, all floors. Which I'm sure the hotel guests got annoyed and the managers. Which, I'm, which I think, in my mind, is the main reason why that failed so much. Okay. I mean, I would have to agree with you. I think that's a huge reason why it failed. I think the second I we I think we knew it was a failure, but I I, I just remember getting into the party room and being told like, "All right, here's your drink, and you gotta be quiet." And I'm like, "What? If, what? The yeah, fuck? I could just I'll leave." Which which is which is why they had you had to be quiet because it was an open concept. Yes, because everybody could hear you. Yeah, yeah, no, 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 I understand. So yeah, so the the hotel there at this time that's gonna be the hotel there at, at actual EY too, correct? Yes. So okay. so mini EY. So, so we're gonna scope it out. Yes, that's how Mini EY works. We scope it out, we see if it's going to be good, and we make our predictions. But I, it all has to do with the hotel. It's still at a Marriott. It's at the Palm Beach Marriott. Yeah, now. I feel like they're just going to always jump from Marriott to Marriott. Yeah, I think they got to deal with Marriott. But I'm uh, hold on. Let me let me go go to the location. Of course, I I've seen photos of this hotel. Looks awesome. Looks great. I haven't seen a single thing. It 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 almost looks like. Like it almost looks like the old anime EY where it was really at. yeah, which apparently that wasn't their original place. That was their second hotel. Yeah, because we didn't go to the original EY. Yeah, no. We went to year two, didn't we? Yeah, we went to year two, not the year one. Does that mean every year except for two they've bounced around? Because that means year two and three was in the same hotel. Then after that they were constant. No wait, year two and three wasn't even in the same one, was it? Year two, three, and I think four were all in the same spot. Then when did we go? Because we only went there what once at that location or twice at that twice at that location. I, thought, I think we went three times at that at that main Marriott. I could have swore it was twice. I could have swore the first time we had a fun time. Maybe. The second time was when you had to bail when you bailed early, and then we're like, "Oh, you're three. We're gonna have a great time," and then they switched. Yeah, that might that might have been what it was. But I based on the based on the images uh, of the hotel. It looks like it's a closed concept hotel. That's good. Which thank goodness because that it, it would have been you would have been setting yourself up for failure if you just picked the same exact type of yeah. hotel. The definition of insanity. It's also north. Which is nice. Going north in Florida is so much better than going south. Oh yeah, 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 yeah. The more north you go, just the better traffic gets, the less the less headache you get. The better the people get. Yeah, bro. It's fucking it's a night to go south. It's a nightmare, which is like one of the main reasons why I don't want to go back to SuperCon. But I do want to go back to SuperCon. I definitely feel like we should go back to Super. I feel like definitely feel like it's been enough of not going to SuperCon to go to it. Yeah. But, anyways, I feel like my predictions for Mini EY, <clears throat> I think it's gonna be good. Okay. The, so are we starting with EY? Because that's not how our day is starting. Yeah. So. Do you want to start with how our day is going to start on yeah. that Sunday? Yeah, sure. So the way this this Sunday is going to be a very very packed day for us. Um, the first thing we're going to do is we're going to hit up a card show at the American Polish Club card show. I think I think that's what it's called. I'm not quite sure what it's actually called. The Palm Beach card show. I think it's. What, I don't fucking remember. I have it. no idea. I just, I just was told by people I know that you should I should you like they're like hey you guys should check it out because. A, a lot of there's a lot of like nice stuff there, and B, not on the banana. Damn it! Okay, hear me out. I spilled my banana flavored banana. Budweiser. Oh, hold on. Now we're cooking. Now you're folks. onto something. Now we're cooking with oil. Um, so I was told, yeah, I was like, hey, there's a lot of nice things here. 
It's a nice venue. And what I was told was like a, one thing that you guys are going to like is only at the show we go to monthly, there are only four people at that show that go to this show. So 90% of the shit you're going to see is going to be like new and new people, which I'm like, okay, I'm a fan of that. Yeah. I like that. That's a good idea. Plus we now have our plans because we know a guy there that knows a guy, which is always fun to know people that know people. We could drop off our stuff actually at this show to get rid of it. Thank God. Yeah. The, the grading stuff, which you guys could see in another video. But so we're going to get rid of that. And I was worried because this is far as fuck. Like it's 45 minutes away from where we are. That's oh, far. <laughs> yeah. And then I checked the maps. I was like, ah, shit, this is 45 minutes. Chris probably isn't going to want to go to this. Chris barely likes to leave the house now. 45 minutes. Dude, I know. Oh, my God. <laughs> and then so I, I look and I'm like, fuck it. Let me just maps EY while I'm at it. EY is an hour. EY is 15 minutes more north than this. I'm like. Oh, this is a literal stop on the way. Perfect. Yeah. Now I won't hear Chris complain. So So now we're going to make most of our trip in the morning. And then when it's like, you know, 30 minutes, 15 minutes before EY opens at 11 o'clock, mm-hmm. we'll just go to EY. Yeah. So it's funny because the thing I heard about this show is the people that uh, I spoke to. Oh, I don't know if you know you, you know Waldo from the show or you noticed him. Waldo? At all? Yeah. I've never seen him. He is... You didn't get that joke? I, I, oh, I got it. <laughs> oh, I got it. Oh, it was not lost. That's not even his real name. That's just his nickname. So I got the joke. What's his real name? <laughs> Waldo. <laughs> <laughs> I know. It was funny because I was texting him and I was like, hey. Oh, shout out to shout out to, uh, to Waldo, by the way. He says he watches all of these, so I really appreciate it. Oh, he you. does? He said he does. Bro, what a guy. He was the one that. Um, I feel bad for not knowing your name now or who you it's are. Waldo. We'll go with Waldo. He well, likes Waldo. If we could find him. And we'll never will. I, I don't know where he is. He's the guy that I usually buy stuff from with the with the wife and the glasses, black hair. Oh. That guy. I know who he is. Yes. We see him every month. I man, I'm just bad with names. <laughs> Dude, sorry, sorry about that. So am I. He 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 texted, he was like, Yeah, it's me and these three people listed three names. I was like, I think I know one of these. I had texted him, I was like, I am not good with names, brother. I yeah, don't know who any I'm of these so people bad are. With names. Sorry about that, bro. But yeah, I was texting him and he was like, hey, I was like, oh, like, when do you want to drop off the stuff? And I was like, okay, well, I can't do it tomorrow. And this was on Friday. I was talking to him. I was like, I can't do it tomorrow because I had a shit ton of plans. I was fucking running around all day yesterday. And then I was like, cool. Can I bring it to you at the show if we go? And he's like, oh, yeah, totally. And I'm like, okay, great. Like, what time? And he's like, oh, yeah, I walk in uh, around 7, 7.30 when they open. I was like, this <laughs> They opened at 7. <laughs> and I was like, damn, I have to drink that early? <laughs> okay. I- oh, my God. Wait a minute. We have to wake up earlier. We got to wake up at, at, like... You have to wake up at, like, 6. I got to wake up at, like, 5.30. Why? How long does it take you to shower? Because didn't you say it was, like, an hour away? No, 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 no. It was 45 minutes, like, further in the day. And remember, it calculates traffic. So we're not going to hit that much traffic. So it'll probably be closer to 35 minutes. Oh, okay. So, yeah, if I'm going to probably get up at like 530 because I'm going to have to shower, get dressed. Because we're going to have to shower, get dressed, and work at a carpool. So you're on the way. Swing by, get you on the way. Yeah. What I would say, though, is I have a cooler at the house. We should probably prepare some bevies the day before. That's going to do Because yeah. I don't think at 6 a.m. we're going to find many places to sell anything. No, no, not really. Maybe gas stations, but. May- well, gas stations, we could hit up on the way to the con so we can get our Jaeger bombs. Yeah. I mean, shit. Also, hilarious thing, because we do the con Jaeger bombs. Side yeah. note, um, before I forget, uh, Sam said she was going to do a Jaeger bomb. As long as it was sugar-free Red Bull. And I cannot wait to see this failure, how this works. Oh, my God. This is going to be awesome. <laughs> we're just chugging that. Are we going to do another vlog? We have to. <laughs> what if we get lost again? Yeah, that's fair. I was going to say, the only reason why the anime fan called vlog hasn't been posted already is because you sent me a fucking... 100% my fault. You sent me a selfie two days ago. 100% my... Well, that's a weird way to frame that. Do you want to put elaborate more into that? No. <laughs> <laughs> I forgot what you look like. <laughs> I've lost all my memories. Yeah, but that will be coming out. Man, that would be... Is that going to come out after this video? But wait, those are two different videos. Because I sent you the thing for the the Lost in the Hallways, not for the... Yeah. Uh, not for the not for the con video. Yeah, no, the Lost in the Hallway. Remember the thumbnail is going to be in that video? 
Oh, you're a hundred percent right. That this is a hundred percent my fault. I realize. Yeah. So I'm. Uh, I apologize. Yeah. Don't worry about it. It's fine. I don't know. Hey, maybe it'll. Maybe the vlog will be before this video comes out, or it'll be tomorrow. Who knows? Hopefully, I don't know. If, hopefully, if the vlog comes out, it could come out Saturday to prepare you guys for Sunday. <laughs> Who knows? Or it won't. Or it won't. I don't know. It's gonna come out this week. Because now I got all the material to put it out. There you go. That's all that matters. So, Are you excited? I, I guess we'll take step by step. Um, yeah. What is the what is the thing you would be you think you'd be excited for most about the show? Because that's our first stop along this show. About trip. the show? Yeah. I don't know. I mean, always seeing new people and what they got is always fun. Mm-hmm. Um, I'm definitely in it for the funnies. Yeah. I don't know. I'll be honest. I'm 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 not really that excited for the card show. I'm more excited for anime EY. Oh, so am I. So what are you more most excited about? Like, what do you think the best thing about EY Mini is going to be? Oh, just like, I feel like exploring the hotel That's is good. going to be probably the one of the best things at EY because it's a new hotel. Mm-hmm. What's around it? I don't know what's around it too because there could be restaurants and shit around the hotel that we just don't we we don't know about yet there could be bangers around it yeah which would be super helpful obviously to scope out now for when we're there for multiple days yeah dude there could be a Publix close by we do like we can only hope we do like our Publix runs (laughs) um that's such that's so fucking funny (laughs) but i'm uh i mean yeah definitely i definitely just think exploring anime ui Mm -hmm. i i know there's not going to be a lot to do at mini yeah I mean, they have, they've only posted that there's going to be the 8-bit band at that place. Is that what it's what called, the is. 8-bit band? I don't know what that is. They play, uh, they play, uh, they play music. Okay. They play, uh, like, some fucking, let me see. 8-bit wave. Yeah, they just play video game music. That's about it. Like, they're real people? Yeah, they're real people. Got, okay. But, uh, that's, like, a. that's the only thing that they've posted That's, like, so a far. thing we're not doing. There's nothing... They haven't posted really anything else, at least on their website. I haven't checked their Instagram. Mm-hmm. I know they have like some cosplayers going. I'm not entirely sure. Got it. I am thinking for actual anime UI. I'm definitely thinking about getting a um, hotel, a, a hotel room. That's definitely a good call. So let's see. They've oh ribbons. We can buy ribbons, which I definitely want to buy ribbons. Yeah. Um, just some guests. There's a Super Smash Brother tournament at one. There's a Street Fighter tournament. That's about it. That's the only, the only thing they've posted. Got it. So, but, you know, I mean, you know how mini EY goes. It's just a small one-day con just, so, you know, to get familiar with the hotel. Yeah. And that's about it. And they've raised their prices. If you just want to get into mini, it's $10, not $5. But, again, if you do buy the three-day pass, um... You get it for free. You get it for free. How much is a three day? I think it's like forty five bucks. Which I mean, I will say this: it is go. It is getting up there in price. Sorry, I will say this: on. very ballsy to raise your price after your worst performance. Not a fan of that one. Very true. Okay, the weekend pass is forty bucks, and their three star pass is six hundred bucks. Wasn't it five hundred? Was always six hundred. No, it was five hundred. So they raised that too. Yeah, it's. Again, very ballsy to raise your prices after your worst performance. Your shittiest performance. Not only your worst performance, but one of of the worst performances I've ever seen from any con ever. And I've been the Mizu con. (laughs) Your sister con. Yeah. And that place sucks. But apparently, didn't we go one time and it was better? Or did we skip it? No, we fucking went. And remember, none of the panelists showed up, so we left early? I do remember this. I do remember this. That, That was just... That was just a series of unfortunate events. That's yeah. not even on them. And the only reason why we didn't go to MizuCon this year is because I was going out of town on yeah. Memorial Day, which blew because I had, I had this, I had this super super guess that it was going to be the best con we go this year because of the convention that it was in. Airport. The airport convention center, but we never went. Yeah, that's funny. I've, with all the cons we've been going to, I've been watching more anime recently. That's a little side note. Yeah. Yeah, and I've realized. A lot of shows. Mm-hmm. Are just shows. Huh? What do you mean? Like, they get really bad. <laughs> like, yeah. No, some, most animes are dog shit. Like, 
like, I don't know if you've ever watched Tokyo Ghoul all the way through. Have you finished it? I've not finished it. I've watched season one, which was I thought I thought the beginning was, eh, but it got really good at the yeah, end. Yeah, yeah. I really liked it. Season one's awesome. Season two, complete dog shit. Yeah. Season three, so uh, and then I watched the two OVAs. Uh huh. Oh, the OVA. Yeah, those are yeah, those are whatever. Oh, I liked them. I thought they were both really good. Oh, I didn't care for them, but that's fine. Okay. And then, well, I like the little camera girl. <laughs> oh yeah, she's cool. And then, um, I'm seven episodes into season three. The not slapping. Dude, the beginning of Tokyo Ghoul Re is a slog fest. It is not clicking. Especially because it like throws you into the deep end. It's like, oh, now we can eat food. There's, he doesn't like, eat food. There's like all this shit. He doesn't eat food. He's always in the background of the table not eating. Yeah. But like now the ghouls can eat food. It's like a whole thing now. That's because they're not real ghouls, Chris. Yeah, I know. But there's like this whole thing where it's like, oh, you have to read the manga. In order to kind of understand also, what's happening. Isn't season two and season three not canon? You no, know, they're canon. Yeah, they happen in the manga. They just skip a lot? Yeah, they skip a lot. Season two, they didn't skip as much. They skipped like maybe a couple of chapters. Season two to season three skipped a ton of chapters. Yeah. So like they just throw you in the deep end. And you're like, what the fuck? Uh, but the end of season three is fire. Oh, okay. Big fan of, big fan of the end of season I'm three. I'm just like, he doesn't know anything. And I'm like, this is stupid. Oh, yeah. No, that sucked. That blue. But um, I'm assuming he learned stuff later, right? Oh, yeah, and it's awesome. All right. Oh, it's awesome. And then uh, what was I going to say to you? Oh, did you see that there's a new Tokyo Ghoul thing coming out? No. Yeah. I don't know what it is yet, but it got leaked because there's been like a billion leaks this week. I don't know. I haven't seen it. Yeah. A million things got leaked. So I was watching that. I was watching Food Wars, too. Food Wars is very good. Is it good? Have never seen it. Uh, yeah, I know. He's got a banner. <laughs> I have a banner up there. and I've never seen Food yeah, Wars. Yeah, it's, it's really good. So far, big fan. I only got that because I had an Akibento box, which is like a a loot box for anime stuff. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Which was cool, but after a year, I was like, meh. I don't need this. <laughs> I have too much shit now. Yeah, too much garbage. So, yeah, I'm very excited for everything coming up. I am very excited. I definitely hope Anime EY is going to be good. The thing with Anime EY, EY is right in the middle of it is Pokemon Go's Community Day for Beldum. So from like two to five, I'm gonna be playing Pokemon Go. Well, I also think if let's say we get to EY Mini at around like eleven, eleven thirty, it's it's mini. There's really nothing to do past an hour. Oh yeah. So it's fine. It'll be an easy do. Check everything out. Do a quick vlog. Probably leave. Do Pokemon. Yeah, I probably won't even try to like come down here and play at the park, but I might just stay up there and try. To, uh, I don't know. It's yeah. Wherever you want. I mean, fuck it. We'll figure it out, man. I'm also giving a mad consideration. I want everybody to do it to at least open a second account on Pokemon Go. I already got one. No, but let, hear me out. Okay. We all start at level one because obviously that's how you start with a second account. Uh huh. And after like a year, or we say until Christmas or something, we all see what level we got to and like our shiny counter. And like winner does this, like third place has to drink this, third place has to drink this, and we just have a full competition. And, like, we have, like, a bunch of items, like, oh, most legendaries and, and most shinies, oh, yeah. like, highest level. Like, I think that'd be fucking awesome for the three of us to do. And it's, like, the loser at the end of, the like, the year has to do X, Y, Z. That would be cool. The only problem is Nick would win because he doesn't do anything else. Well, we have to, we would have, like, um, we would have, like, a, a thing, like, if you spend X amount of dollars, it's held against you. Like, I think that's fair, too. Like, for every dollar, you might, like, lose a point. Yeah. Because what stops you from really spending $100 blowing everybody out of the water and then fucking coming first place and everything? That's very true. But I also think the amount of time that you put in it is going to be – do it. Is, is going to, you know, counteract that. See, this is the whole thing. I think Nick would come in third place. You think so? You want to hear my logic? Sure. My logic is because he is so buried into the game that – he will think this is dumb uh -oh. and, f like, let's say we do it for six months. For the first five and a half months, only focus on his main account. I don't know. We could talk to him about it. I think it'd be a fun competition. It would be fun. I'd have to make a third account. I'd have to make a second. <laughs> yeah, so. But, I mean, it, I think it would be interesting. I mean, but the only thing is then you you wouldn't be grinding on your main account. That's, like, the only thing. Oh, I don't give a shit about that. <laughs> that that's more of a you guys thing. Yeah, but then, like, once you once you get the... Like, once you get to 40, you could max out Pokemon. Like, 100% maxed out. 
And then from there, 50, it's like a, just like a flex thing. See how high you can get. I get you. But uh, I don't know. We'll think about it. It sounds fun. I don't yeah. know if I would. I don't know. I don't know. I don't know. And on that, guys, thank you so much for joining us. We will see you at the show in EY if you guys attend. Hey, thanks for watching Class of 09. Oh, thank you so much. Oh, my God. I'm so glad people like it. I would have cried if it got 20 Dude, views. Dude, I know. I would have been so sad. You know what, though? I also have to respect the people watching it because there's no, like, this isn't on regular Mondays yet. Yeah. It's very funny because I, I posted the first video and something fucked up. There was no of our mic audio. It was only the game audio. Yes. So I don't know what happened with there. And it was up for like an hour. No, nah, I was up for like a couple hours, like maybe four hours. Oh, okay. It had like seven views. And I was like, ooh, that's not looking too good. So then I took it down. I reposted it. It's got 500 views now. Yeah. And I was like, oh, thank goodness. Thank goodness. Yeah, we're not. We're just like, dude. We had so much fucking rec fun recording it. We really hope people like this. I know. It was so fun recording. That's actually what we're going to record right now, right yeah, after Yeah, thank you guys so much. Uh, well, hey, if you did like that, make sure to like, comment, subscribe. And, um, uh, see you in the next one. We'll see you guys in the next one. Bye.